Hi, Scott here. Just going to do a quick review, two minute review on the Toshiba Chromebook 2. So I'm going to set my stopwatch on my pebble. Off it goes. Right, Toshiba Chromebook 2, what can we say? Looks not dissimilar to a MacBook Air in as much as it's silver. Got the Toshiba logo there, this lovely textured top, which you, you need if you're a bit like me and things tend to slip out of your hand. Feels nice in the hand, it's a nice nice weight, easy to carry around in your in your bag. Uh, if we go to the left hand side, we'll notice we've got the power supply there, power inlet. We have USB 2 and a very useful SD slot. Uh, most laptops seem to come with an SD slot nowadays. We've got the headphone jack on the one side there, the right hand side. We've got USB 3 and HDMI and also the obligatory Kensington lock. Right, so what can we say? If you're anything like me, you always try and open it like this from this side. That's wrong. What you need to do is spin it round there. I don't know why that is, guys, but um, I always seem to do it like that. So we're now going to open it up. And there you have that lovely 1080p IPS panel that everyone's raving about. And it is top quality. Uh, you've got microphones there either side of the webcam. As you can see, it probably looks a little bit curved on, the, on this video because I'm using the GoPro. But I can assure you, it's perfectly flat. Sponsored by Score Candy, they put their name against this for the audio. So we're just going to quickly unlock it off camera for you. So we can try and show you the screen, although I don't think this video will do it justice. We've got 20 seconds. So, there's the screen. Obviously a lot of reflection, pretty glossy screen. I was going to hit play on this video so you can get an idea of the audio quality. Cast it up there, Aerosmith. I'm not a huge Aerosmith fan. But de decent, decent speaker quality for such a, a, a cheap device. I mean, I think I think this came in at about £270 in the UK. Uh, they were running a promotion a couple of weeks later, and I think you could get them from around £200 to £230. Pounds. Excellent device, two minute review. I've actually gone 20 seconds over. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care.